Welcome to our channel. Today we are going to delve into the amazing tale of Mrs. Fun Maleo Ransom QT, a trailblazer for women's rights. Born on October 25, 1900, in Abakuta, Nigeria, Francis Abigail Olufun Maleo Thomas, later known as Fun Maleo Ransom Kuti, was destined to become a formidable force in Nigerian history. She was the daughter of Daniel Olumeyua Thomas, a farmer and trader, and Lucretia Phyllis Umwaini Ado Solu, a dressmaker. Fun Maleo was the first female student to attend a Bayokuta Grammar School, setting the stage for her lifelong commitment to education and women's empowerment. After completing her studies in England, Fumaleo returned to Nigeria and married Reverend Israel Alaton Ransom QTE in 1925. Together, they worked tirelessly to improve educational opportunities for Nigerians. Fumaleo organized some of the first preschool classes in the country and arranged literacy classes for lower-income women. In the 1940s, Fun Maleo founded the Abakuta Women's Union, which later evolved into the Nigerian Women's Union and the Federation of Nigerian Women's Societies. She led massive protests against unfair taxes and the exploitation of market women, earning her the nickname Lioness of Lisabi. Her activism forced the ruling Alec of Egbolan to temporarily abdicate in 1949. Fun Maleo's influence extended beyond Nigeria. She was a key figure in Nigerian independence movement and participated in international peace and women's rights conferences. She received the Lenin Peace Prize and was awarded membership in the Order of the Niger for her contributions. Fun Malayo was also the mother of notable figures, including the legendary musician Fela Kuti, Health Minister Olakoi Ransom Kutai, and activist Beko Ransom Kuti. She continued to support her son's criticism of Nigeria's military governments until her death on April 13, 1978, after being injured in a military raid. Mrs. Fumaleo Ransom Kuti's life was a testament to her unwavering dedication to justice, education, and women's rights. Her legacy continues to inspire generations of activists and leaders in Nigeria and beyond. I hope you find this biography captivating and informative. Kindly share and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.